How did you know McCarver had information on the American? I'm not sure I follow. Keller started grilling me on 7th Wave. I told him what I knew. And what was that? <sighs> Rumors, mostly. There was talk of an American running training camps in Afghanistan, freelance guerrilla group in the Philippines with an American advisor. You know, stories like that. And you believed them? Not at first. But then the blanks started filling in. What blanks? Operation Cleopatra. The first time I heard the name William Lennox was when I was posted in Langley. Lennox was a wet work specialist. S4 assassin. Cleopatra was meant to prevent the terrorist bombing in the center of Cairo. It was a disaster. The bomb exploded, killed a lot of people, including Lennox. At least that's what Division thought. Three months later, he turned up in Moscow. Two weeks after, in Seoul. Then Belgrade, Belfast, London. Always one step ahead. And do you think Lennox is connected to Seventh Wave? Connected? <laughs> he started the whole thing. McCarver was brought in yesterday. So how did you know she had info on the American? Sergeant Solomon was in her unit. He tipped me off. Coincidence, that's all. I don't believe in coincidence. What was your brief on the next stop? McCarver wanted an access of advance from the east. Plan was to cross the cemetery on the edge of Nazran and then hit the steel plant on the far side. We were less than a click away when we got hit. Check it out. I thought places like this only existed in movies. Yeah. Well, either way, I don't like it. You kidding me? This is my kind of place. All the type of people I like. Quiet and out of the way. Keep your head on a swivel. Intel reports snipers in the area. See this? Multiple targets bearing down on our location. Take them out. Copy that. We got more hostiles coming in.
God damn it! Inbound.
steam gun! Take it out! Take it out! You did it!
Receiving heavy fire.
says that the division ran a black ops group. Lennox was one of them. No ties, no strings. You expect me to believe we had a terror cell working for us? You can believe what you want. Fact is, Lennox was off the book, so there's no way to prove it. Very convenient. Lennox did the thing in the Congo, the special in the Philippines. This was professional contract terrorism. Lennox held all the cards, started making small deviations here, little switches there. Before long, things got out of hand. Mistakes started being made. Costly, bloody mistakes. Division decided to pull the plug on him. Miami got the call. Lennox took them all out, single-handed. Everything changed after that. So what else did she tell you? CIA's most wanted was Lennox. Different name, different profile, do not approach tag, but it was him. Most wanted terrorist was one of our own. And you believed her? Why wouldn't I? What was your take on the next stop? Destroy a steel plant being used as a weapons factory. Division figured if we couldn't cut off Seventh Wave's head, then the next best thing was to disrupt their operations. It was deemed too dangerous, too politically volatile for a regular strike. So McCarver's crew was tasked. No way anyone in their right mind would volunteer for this. Copy that. Multiple hostiles inbound. Taking fire. 
Can you see smoke or any chimneys? Copy that 2-1, I have visual smoke on the Thank you. 